Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to easily prepare hummus and how to plate it up as a starter. It is extremely tasty and worth every effort. Either you buy the chickpeas in a tin or glass or you cook them yourself. Strain the peas in a sieve and absolutely keep the cooking liquid. I make the effort to peel away the outer skin, as the hummus will be way more creamy. Of course you can skip this work, but that are 15 minutes well spent, should you choose to accept it. Mission accomplished! Then you will need sesame paste called tahini, which you can find here in Germany in a well assorted supermarket with the Mediterranean specialties. Often some oil separates on top. It has to be mixed under and when you have a handheld blender, this is a good method. When filling your stand mixer, remember to keep some chickpeas aside. Now you give all the other ingredients into the container of your blender. 3 tablespoons of tahini, 2 tablespoons of olive oil, a knife tip of cumin, juice of half a lemon, two roughly cut garlic cloves, sea salt and some cooking liquid of the chickpeas. Use only so much that the top of the chickpeas can still be seen. Lit on and you can start blending. I let it run for approximately 20 to 30 seconds. Now you can try and season to your liking. I added two more pinches of sea salt, cooking liquid and a second knife tip of cumin. When you are not used to some spices, it is always advisable to start with half the amounts given in the recipe. Spicing up is far easier than neutralizing. Blending one more time, trying and here we go. We can plate up. For a starter you put three tablespoons of hummus in the center of a plate. With the back of your spoon, you spread it into a circle. You sprinkle some Moroccan paprika around. Those of you who like it spicy, put in the center a dollop of harissa, or you skip this step and place the olive just like this in the center. Then everything will be refined with olive oil, and as a proof that you have made the hummus yourself, you arrange chickpeas on the side. It is also very decorative. Hummus is always served with a salad on the side, for example the classic tomato cucumber salad and of course with pita bread. I'm sure you will make your next hummus on your own. It would be kind if you gave me a thumbs up and subscribed to my channel, it's free. Ingredients and amounts you will find in the description below. See you soon and guten Appetit!